Good morning, Baby Ben, and Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> That's right, Baby Ben. It's Christmas morning. Time to open your presents. What's wrong, Baby Ben? Oh dear, there are no presents in your stocking. Hmm, there must be a mistake. Maybe you've woken up too early and Santa hasn't been yet. Good idea, Baby Ben. Let's go pay a visit to Baby Tom and see if he has his presents. Hi, Baby Tom. Merry Christmas. Oh, dear. That's what we came to ask you about. Baby Ben never got any presents this morning either. I sure hope Santa is okay. I think that's a good idea, Baby Ben. Let's phone Car Patrol and ask them if they can help us find out what's happened to Santa. To the Car Patrol phone. Matt, Frank, Hector, we have a Christmas conundrum. Santa hasn't come to deliver any presents to any of the Car City residents. Oh, huh? What shall we do? I think you're right, Matt. We need to start a search party. Why don't you start searching the streets of Car City and see if anyone has seen anything? Uh huh. Hector, you can search from above, and Frank, you can try looking near the river. Let's save Santa. Mm -hmm. What was that, Hector? Did you hear something? Hector, did you hear that? Is that who I think it is? It is. It's Santa. He's stuck down the chimney. Frank, thank goodness you never went too far. We found Santa. You think you can radio Matt and tell him to come back and help get Santa out of the chimney? Hmm. Hey again, Baby Ben and Baby Tom. Matt, did you get your radio message from huh? Frank? Uh -huh. That's right. Santa is really stuck down a chimney. Let's head back to Car Patrol headquarters and pronto. Hector, Frank, how are you doing? That's great. Frank says Santa is halfway out of the chimney. Where are you going, Frank? Hip, hip, hooray! You did it, Car Patrol. You saved Santa. Okay, Santa? <laughs> you really got a head on your shoulders, baby Tom. But you're right. What about the presents? Look, Frank managed to retrieve the presents from the chimney. You brought so many presents for everyone that you got stuck in the chimney. Maybe we should build a bigger chimney for next year. 
And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. It's present time. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Not for you, Santa. You must have more presents to deliver. Everyone, say thank you and Merry Christmas to Santa before he goes. Thanks, Santa. Merry Christmas to all. The Car Patrol. What a hot day to be patrolling Car City. Matt and Frank look exhausted. An ice cream sounds like a very good idea. Carrie? Oh. Matt and Frank are really hot. Oh. Hmm. And would like some ice cream. Mm -hmm. Can we see what you've got? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh. Oh no! Your ice cream card is missing. Don't worry, hmm. Carrie. Matt and uh? Frank are on the case. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Carrie thinks she might have a clue. She saw the babies on their way to the playground just before she fell asleep. Thanks for the tip-off, Carrie. Mm -hmm. Matt and Frank will have your ice cream back in no time. Hey babies, Carrie's ice cream cart was stolen while she was sleeping and she says she saw you guys just before she fell asleep. The babies promise it wasn't them. What do you think, Matt, Frank? Do you believe them? Then the hunt for the thief continues. Hey, Amber. Amber's on her way to help Tyler. He's sick after eating too much ice cream. You're right. He must be the ice cream thief. You'd better follow Amber. There he is. Looks like you've had your fair share of ice cream, Tyler. 
Amber will take care of you while Matt and Frank take that cart you stole back to Gary. Carrie, Matt and Frank found your cart. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. <laughs> Carrie's really grateful, guys. Now everyone can cool down with an ice cream. Uh -huh. And here come your first customers, oh, Carrie. Oh. Kids, Carrie is sorry she accused you of stealing her ice cream cart, and she'd like to give you all an ice cream. And of course, you both get one too, after all your hard work. Have a great afternoon chilling out, everyone. And thanks, Car Patrol! Hi, Tom! Hi, Baby Tom! Having fun? Way to hustle, Baby Tom! Tom, can you pull Jerry's raft out of the lake? Follow Tom, baby Tom. Where's baby Tom? You'll get back to Jerry later. Let's call Car Patrol. I'm sure baby Tom's around here somewhere. We have an emergency, guys. Baby Tom is missing at the lake. Can you help? Hurry, guys. Yes, Tom can't find Baby Tom. You're right, Frank. He's probably playing a prank, but better safe to search. Where could Baby Tom be, guys? Under the picnic tables? Maybe he's playing at the river. Hey, there's Jerry's raft. Yes, Tom will get that later. Baby Tom was playing with a football, not a water pistol. Watch out, Matt and Frank. 
Well, no need to rescue the raft. <laughs> What's that, Matt? Oh. Huh? You think that's baby Tom's wrench? Oh, uh, Lida. Oh. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Maybe baby Tom is playing at the playground? Uh huh. Look, it's baby Tom. Yes, baby Tom. Why aren't you at the lake? There was an emergency? The babies needed another player for football, so you went with them? Yes. Why didn't you tell your father? It's not nice to disappear. You forgot to tell Tom baby Tom was going to the playground? Good work, Car Patrol. Case solved. Have fun, babies. See you next time, friends. Bye. Hi, Ben. Mm. Hi, Jeremy. Mm. You guys are working long hours. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm. You've been driving since yesterday morning? Mm -hmm. That's crazy, Jeremy. Mm. Want Ben to make you a snack? Mm -hmm. mm. You probably just want to get home. Good night, then. Mm. Mm. Oh, dear. Look at that fog. Jeremy can't hear you, Ben. He's gone into the fog. Look, there's Jeremy's muddy tire marks. Why is he not coming out of the fog? Let's call Car Patrol for help. Guys, we have a bit of a mystery here. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Jeremy's left Ben's farm and drove into a patch of fog. He's not responding to Ben's horn and hasn't come out. Mm. Huh? Huh. Can you help? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Great. Let's go. Car Patrol is here, Ben. Matt and Frank are on the other side of the fog, looking for clues. What can you tell Hector? Mm. There's where Jeremy went into the fog patch. Can you guys check if there are any tire tracks coming out on the other side?
No tracks on this side. That's strange. Did you hear that? The fog is growling. The guys heard it too, Ben. Is that special sonar equipment, Frank? To hear what's happening in the fog? Whatever creature is making that noise sure sounds like he's hungry. Huh? What is it, Frank? Uh, Lila. You think it's Jeremy's tummy making that noise? It could be. Jeremy didn't eat all day. Huh? But why isn't Jeremy coming out of the fog? Maybe he's injured. Huh? Matt is going to go into the fog. You fly overhead, Hector, and shine your spotlight down so he can see. Ben, you shine your high beams into the fog on your side. There. Is that Jeremy? Why isn't he responding? What's that noise? Huh? Is he snoring? Uh -huh. Huh? Jeremy is asleep. <laughs> Jeremy couldn't see, so he Ooh. decided to take a nap. Thank goodness you're okay, Jeremy. Car Patrol would like to escort you back to Car City and buy you some breakfast. How does that sound? Great. Let's go. Thanks for your help, Car Patrol. Goodbye, everyone. See you next time. Hi, Baby Pickle and Baby Charlie. Have you had a nice day at the beach? It looks like the tide is coming in. Time for you to be heading home. Troy's broken down and is blocking the road. It looks like you're trapped on the beach, babies. You need help. Great idea, Baby Pickle. The car patrol can help you. Oh. Hi, Car Patrol. Uh -huh. Troy the train is broken down next to the beach. Baby Pickle and Baby Charlie are trapped and can't get out. Can you help them? Uh -huh. Here comes the car patrol. The babies are excited to see you. What have you seen, Matt? 
A pain in bum bum bum. Troy has leaked fuel. That's why he's broken down. Oh. Hmm? Oh. 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 Hector says he's going to go and get Troy some more fuel. Uh -huh. It looks like the tide is starting to come in. You'd better get to a higher point on the beach, babies. <laughs> Here's Hector. Now don't spill any this time, Troy. Oh. Oh. Bye, Troy. Oh, 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 oh. Now the road is all clear. But it looks like the tide has come in. The babies are trapped. I think Frank has thought of something. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Don't be nervous, babies. Uh -huh. Frank will pull you safely across the water. Hello? Hello? Are you having fun? You're all safe now, babies. Hello? Hello? Well done, Car Patrol. Oh. See you next time. Hey, Harvey, mm -hmm. where are you going? I will be to the field to see all those beautiful flowers you planted. Mm -hmm. Great, we'll come too. Mm -hmm. What's wrong? Your flowers? Who would do such a nasty thing? What are you going to do? <coughs> Call car patrol and track down the naughty car who made this mess? <coughs> Guys, we have a problem. Somebody has dug up all of Harvey's flowers. Huh? Can you help him track down the naughty car who did it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Great. Let's go. Sorry about your flowers, Harvey. Shall we see if we can spot any clues? Ah. Uh-uh. Huh? 
Bop, bop. Hey guys, Matt's found something. <laughs> Whoever damaged Harvey's flowers has left a trail. If we follow it, we might find the naughty car. Uh -huh. Lily! <gasps> It was you who dug up Harvey's flowers. Aww. Look who's here, guys. I think Lily has something to tell you. Uh -huh. You lost your necklace in Harvey's field? Dug up all his flowers looking for it? Mm. Mm. <gasps> Sorry about your necklace, Lily. Maybe the car patrol could try and find it. Uh -huh. Great job, Matt. But we need to do something about Harvey's flowers. Uh -huh. Awesome job, Car Patrol. Two problems solved at once. See you next time. <laughs>